the moment it does seem like the odds are stacked against the pm but um i will never rule out a last minute a surprise i think it has less to do with uh, the way he is governed and it's more to do with um sort of who stores he stepped on the crisis as it were seems to have emerged when uh, imran khan wanted to retain the current the incumbent uh, dg isi the then government so dg isi um who was said to be favorable towards uh, the government right and that created a bit of a flap uh, with the military brass the opposition has been trying to deceive the prime minister well ever since he became the prime minister so, um they are pointing towards um what they call misgovernance they're talking about uh, crucial decisions that were not taken in time they are of course talking about what they uh, call economic mismanagement in which you can include inflation it is entirely likely that the supreme court will rule against that and say that no that's that's uh, you know overly punitive right but the process does take time but i think we're heading towards uh, elections in in pakistan um and i think that might end up happening regardless of how the vote of confidence goes down